Well, this morning, the family of a man shot and killed by police in Lancaster is opening up about what happened. The sister of 27 year old Ricardo Munoz says her brother suffered from multiple mental illnesses. Police body cam shows uh, Munoz wielding a knife at the time he was shot. As Fox 43's Grace Griffin explains, family members say Munoz was having a schizophrenic episode. That image that the cops put out there of my brother is not my brother. That wasn't him. He was schizophrenic. It probably had multiple personalities, who knows? Behind the smile, Relenis Muniz says her brother Ricardo battled mental illness. Diagnosed with schizophrenia in his early 20s, she said he also suffered from bipolar disorder. When the deadly shooting happened outside their mother's home on Laurel Street in Lancaster, she says Ricardo wasn't himself. My mom called me. She said that my brother was having an episode. That she, she needed to be admitted to be evaluated and to be on meds. Muniz says Ricardo frequently had episodes and could not remember where he was or what he did during those times. It could get crazy because at the end of the day, he doesn't know what he's doing. I'm pretty sure if he would have been alive, he, he would have snapped back and he would have not known what he had done. Muniz says her mother called the Lancaster Bureau of Police, not 911, and also crisis intervention, hoping he could receive help. It had the, the police officer not shown up yesterday and had someone who was familiar with... That wouldn't have happened. That wouldn't have happened. Do you blame the police officer for what happened? I blame the system for what happened. We call for help. If mm -hmm. they could have came here, but they, the procedures that they have to deal with people that have mental issues are not correct and they need to change that. After the shooting, demonstrators gathered in the city. Late in the night, things turned violent, but Muna says her family doesn't condone the destruction. I'm tired of minorities getting killed because it's mainly minorities getting killed by cops. So, I mean, you could protest, but protest in peace. There's no need for violence. She says she wants people to know the man in this video was not himself. My brother was a sweet boy. He cared. He cared about people. That wasn't him. In Lancaster, Grace Griffin, Fox 43 News.